I remember. You call this a bike? It may not be a fancy drifter bike, but it gets the job done. Get on. I used to be a cop. So, how's she doing? The girl that I brought in, Lisa. Are you, are you gonna take me to see her? No. God damn it, Ricky. What, what the hell? Why not? I can't. She's not here. Wait, wait, hold on for a second. Where is she? A few days ago, Schizo assigned her to a scavenge run. She and three others headed over to the rope camp to look for supplies. They came back without her. You're telling me they left her? They left her, out in the shit! They didn't leave anyone. They said she ran off. Jesus! It could have been anything. Wolves, freaks, rippers. Choose your poison. What? What? What was Schizo thinking, sending her out on a supply run? Everyone's gotta work, Deke. That's the deal, and you know it. I don't believe this shit. Look, she'd been surviving in Marion Forks for years when I found her. Yeah, then maybe you should have left her there. Who's there? Hey. Get back, don't make me blow your goddamn Who's head there? off. It's me. No, get back! Oh. Hey. Hey, it's, uh, it's Ricky. <laughs> you remember me? I rode with you guys a year ago. Ricky. What? Tumalo? Yeah. That's the... Tumalo to... to Lost Lake? Yeah. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. That's right. How are you doing there, loser? You doing all right? PG. It still didn't give you the right to steal our shit. Are you kidding me? Look at his arm. What was I supposed to do? Huh? I don't know. Maybe ask. Jesus. Look at you guys, the biker boys. The most badass drifters in this shit, right? And now you come back crawling to Iron Mike. Oh, wait. If he'll let you. <laughs> come on, just help me get him back to Addy. Let's go. Come on, pal. I still need your help. <clears throat> Ricky. Yeah, Boozer Ricky. Where, where are we going? Addie said she's agreed to, to take a look at your arm and, and see what she can do. What? No. No, you're not taking me to some goddamn camp. I can ride, damn it. Not sa Damn it. Boozer, it's just for a few days. Get some shit for your arm and then... No. You know what it's like there, Deke. No, you're not thinking straight. This isn't the Hot Springs. This is Lost Lake. Iron Mike. Remember him? Iron Mike? Who's gonna get us killed? He said. That was a long time ago. They built the place up. They, they got more people. We're all gonna fucking die. We'll be long gone before anything like that happens. Camp's got the only dock in a hundred miles. Now, Addie, just, look, she'll take care of it. Just, just a couple of days. Yeah, then we ride the hell out of here. Right north, like you said. Get the hell away from us in my classroom. Yeah. Yeah, we ride north. Leave all this shit behind. College, a bunch of stay at home. Okay, so I'm gonna go back and check on him and make sure he's okay. Coward. Yeah, you got that right. Well, how long? And until he can ride, I mean. You mean how long do you have to be here? 
Look, we have antibiotics, but it's not enough. If Iron Mike lets you stay, your friend will have a chance. So what happened? How'd he burn his arm like that? We ran into some rippers south of Belknap. Guess they didn't like his tattoos. Jesus. I've heard about them doing shit like that to themselves, but not to people they're trying to recruit. <sighs> Boozer wasn't any goddamn recruit. Oh, uh, guess Tucker should have made a deal with him like Iron Mike. Come on, Ricky. He just, he doesn't get it. Carlos isn't gonna honor any deal with Lost Lake, not for long anyway, and Mike, he just doesn't see it. He sees more than you think. You've always had your good side, Deke. You've just been doing your best to kill it. Thanks for the vote of confidence. You cannot believe a word he is going to say. Addy is soft. Mike, we do not have enough for those that pull their own weight, let alone a goddamn cripple. He's oh, not a cripple. On. He can work. He... I say we throw them out on their asses. Mike, that is not who we are. Jesus. Listen to you. And you. You tired of being Tucker's little bitch, finally? Raymond, huh? stop it! Don't call me that. I'm pretty tired, all right. All right, See? enough! See? You know who the fuck this guy is, and you know what he... You hold on! And you! You put that shit away. Mike, Deacon was I one that know. brought me the good. I know. And I know what kind of man he is. What he's done. He done any worse than you? Ricky? How about me? We've all been out in this shit, Schizo. We've all done things we're not proud of. We need another rider. Oh, now, wait a minute. I just need a few days and some antibiotics. I'll do whatever it takes. Sure, Mike. Whatever you say, I'm on board. Walk with me. I don't trust don't you. Don't start with me. So you're the one who brought them in. I didn't bring them in, Schizo. Boozer needed help. But he broke into the infirmary. The tackle shop isn't exactly secure. You were supposed to fix that weeks ago. Oh, so what? You're hooked up with Addie, so now I gotta go over and fix her locks? Ricky told me you stopped running for job? Tucker. Sent no, that little girl here my instead. My job I'm sorry I lied to you Addie's before about doing runs system. for Tucker. How long you been drifting, you and Bill? I don't know. Like I said, time gets lost. Your folks don't put down some roots. Figure this shit out. Grow some food. Come next spring? Won't be none of us left. If you give Boozer what he needs, let us hold up here till he can ride. Like I said, I will do whatever you need. I just, I, I want you to know that as soon as he's patched up, we're gonna put together some gear, we're gonna ride north. North, huh? There's a camp up there near Smith Rock. Boozer's never been there. Got a lot of ghosts down here. It's time to move on. Fresh start, eh? Yeah, I can respect that. Now go on. Leave me be. I got some thinking to do. Sure, Mike. Yeah, whatever you say. Just have Ricky radio me if you need something.
the hell do you want? Hey. Never buys anything worth shit. Deacon, hey. Is everything okay? What's wrong? Uh, actually, that's not why I'm here. Okay. Came by to see if there's anything you need for the uh, infirmary. Actually, we're running low on everything. I mean, we could always use more meds, sterile bandages, instruments. Uh, here. Hmm. A Liston knife. Yeah, it was used by doctors in the Civil War to perform operations in the field. Operations? Yeah, you know, when they didn't have any anesthesia or laudanum. I wrote down where you might be able to find one. <laughs> it's the brochure for the visitor center at Sherman Sherman's camp. camp yeah, yeah, the plate's crawling with all the freakers. I'll see what I can do. Yeah, uh, Deacon. Thank you. Head to Sherman's camp. The place is gonna be crawling. Hey. Yep. Bye. Oh, it's you. I got it. Give me a second. <sighs> Chopper that night. Yeah, 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 I know, okay. First, you gotta do something for me. What? You need something from me? Look, there's a digital display on your radio. I'm going to send you a coded message. Coordinates. Meet me at that location. O'Brien, what the hell is this all about? Just meet me there. There'll be Nero soldiers all around me like before. Don't let them see you. O'Brien out. That's right, I gotta burn out the rest of these nests. Sniper ambush, oh god damn it. I'll come back later and finish burning out these nests. Here it is. Visitor's center. Gotta find a way inside. Yeah, 
Time to light it up. The door's locked. somewhere. Down here. Not much left. This place would have been picked up for clean. Liston knife. This is it. Gotta get it back to Addy. I got that knife you were looking for. Thank you. You have no idea how badly we need this. No problem. Glad to help. here. Open the gate. No trouble. Okay. Hey. Hey. Oh. Here's that knife you were looking for. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. 